A new report from Axios charts the access that one Chinese spy got to prominent U.S. politicians. The alleged spy even had intimate relationships with a couple of Midwestern mayors. Her name? Christine Fong. And according to an Axios investigation, a suspected Chinese intelligence operative who targeted up-and-coming politicians from 2011 to 2015. It began years ago, it is alleged, through charm and campaign fundraising. That's ABC's Martha Raddatz. We're going to start with Alex. What are some uh, warning signs that a potential love interest may actually be a foreign spy? 30 seconds. I think any time they start by saying, so, like, do you know any other mayors who might have interesting national security information? Like, that's, that's a big lead right there, especially if they say all those words directly. If you only bump into them at, fun, at events where you see national mayor conclaves, that's a big sign. Um, you know, if they have a dapper demeanor and seem to be constantly... Uh, running around de- detonating things. That's another third sign. I thought I was with three. Matt Napolitano, 30 seconds. Hey, y'all remember when Eric Swalwell ran for president? Wasn't that a fun two weeks? <laughs> that being said, I don't know. understand the process that goes into looking into these internships in Washington and the fact that people don't catch on to where you are meeting these people what the conversations are having, as Alex mentioned. It really makes no sense to me how this goes under the radar completely. And now all of a sudden it pops up and it's like, oh, well, I guess I got fooled. This isn't punk. These are people that are coming on to national security secrets, things that are going on within the inner workings of our government. In the words of Cisco, is fong, 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 fong. And uh, Matt Ryan, uh, what are some warning signs that a potential love interest may be a foreign spy? 30 seconds. If she's talking into her watch, she might be a Chinese agent. If she's got something that makes clicking noises in the middle of the night, she might be a Chinese agent. If she actually likes the TV show The Americans and has points of reference to it, she might be a Chinese agent. So, yeah. You just may want to watch out for those things. And also, if she has an unorthodox amount of just those little cassette tapes, then she's a Chinese agent. (laughs) This is Master Debaters, the show where the best argument wins. From 550 KTSA and FM 1071.